Yes! Another successful title defense for the Central States Heavyweight Champion. Following through on my word, putting this title forward every week. Another challenger. I got Roger Malcolm coming up. Oh, I just want him to be 100%. Our last match, I hit him with a high impact move. It wasn't my intention to hurt him. I just wanted the win. Not your intention? No, Roger. I didn't want to hurt you. I just wanted to win. Sure felt intentional. It wasn't. It wasn't. 100%, huh? You want me to wait until I'm 100%? I do. I don't think I can wait that whoa, long. Whoa, whoa. Guys, guys, guys. Hold on, hold on. Roger. You don't need to be here. This R is between Roger, us. Roger, I know you want this. Yeah, I earned the title and, shot and, for that. It, Charlie, I know and you want this He's trying to put too. it off. He's trying to invade it. He All tries right. to intentionally injure Charlie, me to avoid to a match sure in the future because he doesn't want to lose that title. You need to make sure he's at 100%. You know you're talking to I want to the best Roger right, Guys, Malcolm. guys, 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 give me time. Let me get this set up. Let me get it signed. This will happen. You'll get your shot when you're 100%. Oh, I'm going to get the shot. When you're 100%, Roger. I'll leave it with that title, Charlie D. When you're 100%. Come on, come on, Roger. I told you that you were dead to me. I told you that the McRoberts name was dead to me and that you were no longer my father. And yet tonight you still showed empathy. You still showed care and love. It's cute. It's all you have because you know you're a washed up wannabe whose prime was past them 10, 15 years ago. And this tonight, after I planted you on the mat, when you tried to show that care and remorse, you might have got up. But next time, you won't. Once again, I am your Supreme Light Heavyweight Champion. And with that being said, I am open to any and all competitors. So if you want a shot at the Light Heavyweight title, come down to 2520 Lanier Drive, Supreme Wrestling, and let's see what you got. Hey fans, what a great night of wrestling we had tonight here at Supreme. I tell you, the matches were outstanding. Tony, we Tony, Tony, Tony. And when am I going to get some singles title shots around here? I know you put me in a tag team title match tonight, but I'm not a tag team wrestler anymore. Van, do you feel like you've earned those titles? Have of you matches? seen the blood I've spilt for this company, Tony? Well, you did beat Billy Mattern in that cage match. Yeah. I'll give you that. Yeah, I think I'm deserving of some singles title matches around here. I mean, Eric Draven got one tonight. He didn't win Surviving the Steel. He didn't beat anybody. And he's in a singles title match. Why can't Van Mardigan have a singles title match? Well, you're right about that. I can keep you in mind for the future. Keep me in mind. Okay, keep me in mind. Now, I don't know if you know the history of Supreme, Tony. The last time a guy that was in charge around here didn't give me a title match, you might want to go view some video. Beta Nieto, Eta Velocipiat, Israziz, Zavovia. I don't understand Roger. He needs to think about his career, his health. I want to wrestle him just as much as he wants to wrestle me. But he needs to. Hold think on, about hold on, hold on. You really think that you beat me for the Central States Championship in that match? You really think that that was a successful title defense? I I come out there and I shook your hand because I thought we were having a competitive contest. I heard what you just said about Roger Malcolm and how you hurt his neck and you didn't mean to. I know what you are. You're an opportunistic punk. You took the one move. I made a mistake. You moved out of the way. I struck my knee on that steel turnbuckle and you took advantage of it. I'm coming for that. If Roger don't take it from you, I am. And if Roger takes it from you, I ain't afraid to come after him too. Make sure you get that ring fixed. I hit my knee on some steel, Jack. It ain't supposed to be steel in them buckles. Oh, 